Here is an interesting question, which might seem easy, but in reality a little bit tricky. Rachel would like to report progress of Agile team during a sprint and would like to graphically show the work which has been completed using Agile reporting mechanisms. Which chart should she choose? She has five choices and she needs to select all that apply. Choice A – Burn up chart. Choice B – Burn down chart. Choice C – Drill down chart. Choice D – Again chart. And last but not least, choice E – Bar chart. Take a close look to see if you can come up with the answer. Are you ready? Let me share with you my version of the solution. And obviously, if you have a better way to solve it, please make sure to post in comments. I think the correct answer here is choice A – Burn up chart. Burn up chart represents how much work has been completed on the project. It typically shows how many story points were estimated for the sprint and how many of them gradually completed throughout the sprint. If you look at the sample, you see that 75 story points were estimated and then the completion over the period of 10 business days were 5, 7, 7, 15, 27, 29, 37, 41, 59 and then jumping to 75. Which tells us that most of the time completion is uneven and accelerates toward the end of the sprint. There are several agile reporting mechanisms to show progress and share updates with the stakeholders. They are product backlog, sprint velocity, item process timeline, burn down chart as well as the burn up chart. As we now know, the correct answer here is choice A, burn up chart. But let's look at the incorrect solutions. Burn down chart. Even though choice B, burn down chart demonstrates remaining work, it is not a correct answer. And the reason I think it is incorrect, because Rachel is looking to show completed work, not the remaining work. Choices C, D and E are valid charts in a business environment, but they do not represent agile mechanisms to show the progress. For example, drill down chart provides ability to drill down and see additional level of details, but it is not used in agile. Again chart used in waterfall project management and bar chart shows graphical representation of data, quantities or numbers using bars. I try to put a bar chart based on the sprint burn up chart. You can still represent the data this way, but it is typically not used in Agile. So the correct answer here is choice A, burn up chart. Do you have a different answer? Please make sure to post your answer in comments so we can all learn.